Well, yes, we've just enjoyed a wonderful week with um, Ava Chernak and her husband, Rashid Halimal. Uh, they were both instructors at the camp. It was a marvelous experience. But Eva, let, tell us about your experience as a teacher at the camp. Well, um, it was a wonderful experience. It was my first time teaching at the camp. I've been there as a camper before. But as a teacher, I found it was wonderful that I could see my students not just every day, you know, for another class, but, you know, if we forgot to say something or, you know, had to check out some information, I could find them easily and just tell them, you know. And, and we even had a, I was teaching finger symbols as well, kind of an impromptu class, it wasn't on the schedule, but um, we had a question about a rhythm, so we went to consult with Suren and Scott Marcus, and we got it all sorted out, and you know, it was great to have it all right there in the neighborhood, you know. <laughs> so, um, you know, normally we do that by email and phone, and it takes a month to get it right, you know, but everything's right there. <laughs> well, tell us about the show that you performed on Turkish Night. Oh, yeah. That was just a Romani, a Turkish Romani dance. It was all of maybe six or seven minutes, you know. Um, of course, we had um, Omar Faruk Tekbilek playing and his son Murat and um, a few other musicians that were up there. Um, and he the, played for you? The music, yeah. Mashuka, you were telling me about what you found about Eva in the bio you were doing of Absolutely. her. Absolutely. You know, I wrote her bio for a magazine because I wanted to um, not only let the public know that she received the Lifetime Achievement Award um, from the Bella Vianzi of the Universe mm -hmm. at San Antonio. Yeah. For this year. For <laughs> 2009. Every year. You know. what, what's the award again? The Lifetime, Life Achievement. Lifetime Achievement. Achievement. So it's not for a year. No, no it's a, m my lifetime, but every year there's another, you know, lucky person. <laughs> but the important part is, is for us to know a little bit more about Ava's background. Now we know her as an excellent Turkish dancer, um, who knows every style, Turkish style dancer, I'm not who, has led, who has led um, many tours to Turkey and um, knows much about the culture and the music and the rhythms. But in fact, she has actually worked in um, Egypt. And let, tell us a little bit about your Cairo experiences. When was this? Yeah, <laughs> I can't remember when my last trip was, but I started going to Egypt in 1980 <laughs> and uh, went there 23 times. And each time was, the first time I went for four months, and all the other times it was around two months. What did you do for four months? Uh, worked. As? <laughs> worked with uh, Samir Sabri, he's a singer, and he has a troupe, and he has some solo dancers, like the troupe does folklore, and then he has some uh, solo belly dancers, and he usually has foreign, he likes the foreign ladies to work at, because he sings songs about blonde hair and all this. <laughs> and he's a, actually a movie actor, and uh, so I worked with him, and um, it was Mahmoud Red actually, when I first landed in Cairo the first time, um, it was on the advice of a singer who used to be in his troupe, that I met in London on my way, you know, and he said, go to Mahmoud Reza, he'll set you straight. And of course he did, and it was New Year's Eve when, you know, a few days after I arrived, and I said, I have to dance on New Year's Eve, and so I told Mahmoud, I said, what do I do? And he sent me to Samir Sabri, and Samir put me in the show right away, um, and then he said, well, you're gonna work with us. Wow. So that was four months of that, you know. <laughs> didn't need a license in those days, huh? Uh, if I needed one, I didn't have one. <laughs> <laughs> but then I kept going back, and whenever I came back, uh, Samir would know about it, and he, I even went to Cyprus with him once. I came back just for ten days, and he said, we're going to Cyprus. Okay, you know, we <laughs> And, but mostly I went back after that to lead my tours that I used to 
lead, and I haven't been doing them to Egypt for quite a while now. It's been probably, maybe 2001 might have been the last tour I did to Egypt, but I've been doing them to Turkey and even one to Morocco. So, Mashuka, what we were saying, you're the, you were the warm-up act for some of our stars no, that we love? No, not the warm-up. <laughs> I, I mean, not me, but Samir Sabri was the star. So he came at the end of the night. He came, I mean, he was on at the end of the night. So. Stations have been brought to you by Gilded Serpent.